guys, welcome to Nendo Twin 22. Vanessa here speaking, and today we have unboxing of this beautiful outfit. Okay, um, actually, it's been a long time, guys, that I did unboxing. I have been very busy um, towards my other channel, and now I finally have some time. And actually, I'm unboxing this one because I need it for an event. Okay, that I was about to attend this day. Um, anyway, let's begin on. So, first of all, you know, this is, um, actually, I don't understand what's written. <laughs> um, an outfit for an doll. Okay, but I'm gonna try to fit it for Obitsu at the same time for Kopush body. So, we can check about the fitting. Still now, I don't have any Sylvanian body yet, but I just hope I may have it in the future. So this is Nendoroid doll outfit cafe girl, okay? And this is what's inside um, this one, okay? This is the dress, and then um, what they call the stockings, and then apron, and also shoes. Okay, let's see. So this is the front, and it has Good Smile Company, Nendo Doll, and then the description, and I don't understand what's written here. <laughs> okay, I don't speak um, Japanese, guys. I don't understand. So anyway, let's open. Okay, let's unbox and see what's inside. <laughs> okay. I just hope that... Oh, dear. I'm, br I'm breaking it apart, man. <laughs> I just don't have any staple remover. I just hope that I won't hurt my my hand. <laughs> I only got um scissors, so probably I'll just use scissors. Um, let's see if there's zip lock here. Oh no, there's no zip lock, guys. But I want to keep um I want to keep the plastic, to be honest. Okay, I just got there some staple wire, you know, remover. <laughs> right, I'm back again, guys. So I was able to gather this staple with staple remover and also this one. I don't know if that will work, but let's try first this. <laughs> I just hope that it works. Okay, let's see. I'm not quite sure how this works. <laughs> like that. Okay. I'm not sure it, if it worked properly. There you go. I just want to keep the plastic for this, and of course, you know, um, this photo as well i want to keep that so i can include it in my album for the clothes i used to organize mine by albums that's what i do so let's see i don't know why i feel nervous <laughs> Probably nervous of, you know, I might destroy this stuff. Okay, yeah. Finally, we got the staples out, so I just put it aside. And then put this aside as well. <laughs> Alright, so here we go. We're gonna see. Oh dear, it's hard to remove. Oh, no wonder why. There is um, a tape. I don't know if you see, there's a tape, see? There's a tape there. That's preventing us from... This packaging is kind of depressing. <laughs> You're so excited and you can't remove it. Um, Alright. Probably they make sure that, you know, um, 
the item was safe inside that's why they have oh dear i'll just use my scissors and see if it works obviously i don't have any tape remover <laughs> all right so let's see oh so let's remove the plastic and here it is Ta-da! so yeah we got this dress apron and then the stockings shoes Ooh. i just hope it's the right shoes left and right okay so first of all we're gonna tackle on with the shoes first okay small items first okay and we'll see the dress last all right so obviously we need a scissor there you go so here it is here is the shoe so it is um the left oh no the right there's r i don't know if you can see but there's r the letter R there means it's for the right foot of your doll. So here is the top. Here is the side. Very detailed. And this is the bottom top. Okay, that is for the right shoe. And then this one is for the left. Let's hope it's the right L. Okay, so let me check. Yeah, it's L. I don't know if you can see it's L. Letter L. So this is the top of the shoe. And this is the sides. And this is the bottom. So, wow, perfect shoes. So I put it here. So I won't misplace it. Okay, let's... Let's see what else we got. Let's see the stockings. See if it's good. <laughs> I just hope I won't knock the camera, guys. <laughs> I'm really sorry if accidents do happen. My gosh. Um, <laughs> sometimes um, I accidentally knock my camera. <laughs> okay, by the way, I'm using a new phone right now because the old one that I usually use is broken. And um, I also bought a new mic because the new phone, I don't know why, um, that the latest version of Samsung has a low microphone sound or their adaptability is low compared to old phones. And it's really shocked me the fact that it's latest than my other phone. So anyway, here is the stocking. So this is obviously, I think that this is the back because we have here, yeah. So this is the front. Okay, if that's the case, this is the front of the stockings. So small. <laughs> okay, and this is the back. And this is what it looks like. So why I said it's the back because I don't know if you can see properly. I'm really sorry about the lighting. I'm using natural light. So, yeah, this is the stockings, and then finally, we'll see the dress, okay? What does it look like? So, I just place all the items here on my side, so I won't get confused. Now, we'll check. <sighs> da -da -da -da. <laughs> mm. This is the made clothes, so um, there's an apron here, obviously, so we're gonna um, first see the apron, alright? Just place it here, so for the apron, I guess you can see, this is the front of the apron, and 
it was it has this I don't know what it's called <laughs> actually okay sorry guys my vocabulary is low <laughs> anyway so this is there's a ribbon design on its back as you can see and you will attach it by this see so let's tackle in about um about the back oops so here is the back of the apron wow nicely done right it's very pretty so forgive the noise guys don't worry my battery is there <laughs> all right so anyway here is the final it is um the dress itself okay so for the dress itself you know um this is the front wow very nicely done guys oh, okay i forgot to show to you especially what it looks like okay at the back i didn't show it to you very closely but this time i will show to you <laughs> for god guys forgive so anyway this is the front very nice design and here is the back so for the back i'm gonna see that wow it's nicely done guys i just hope that it fits because the last time you know i got errors with regards to the dress and i have to reach out good smile about it so yeah anyway it's also nicely done and it has this i don't know what it called it's called at the bottom wow and then here it says nendo doll good smile company made in china so yeah there you go and then now let's begin on with the fitting of the dress <laughs> all right so for the fitting of the dress we have four dolls here so for the first one we're gonna try it with nandoroid doll that has you know um not big boobs okay for the fitting and i'm using a long neck same goes with this one all right because we have a collar in our dress and i use long neck um neck joints so that it may look well okay when they wear something with collar or or high neck you know clothes so anyway um this is for the next one next doll so for this it's again an endo doll but this time it has boobies okay big boobies <laughs> okay and then the next is for kapush doll okay and this is the kapush doll the next is obitsu so anyway there you go and let's begin first with the nando dolls so first of all guys okay let's begin by making the doll wear the stockings all right so for this um let's remove first <laughs> the head okay so we can easily fit the dress okay on the doll please pardon my doll guys it has a um what do you call this that's, that's a problem with nando dolls with um, matte body right because you know it easily get dirty um anyway mine got dirty because of the clothes that it wear so let's see Actually, I'm a busy person. That's why I don't really have time <laughs> to take good care of my dolls, to be honest with you. Um, let's see. Really forgive, guys, if sometimes, you know, I won't reply back right away. So, I had another YouTube channel that took a lot of my time and energy and effort and... I only, you know, um, unbox videos if I have time and I just do this for fun, okay? 
pastime. <laughs> and Nando doll is actually one of my hobbies. And I don't actually collect before I do, guys, okay? But then I realized that I'm becoming very greedy with regards to it. So that's why I rather not to, okay? Not to... Um, not to collect and now i have these nanto dolls for videos okay and i really love to make um music videos by dolls so let's see if the fitting is right for the actually it's very hard to you know to wear it on the doll actually it looks small see So, for the fitting with regards to the Nando doll that has boobies, we'll just gonna try the dress, okay? So, we won't have any hard time, you know, to make the doll wear the stocking. So, I think that it could just reach here. Oh, dear, it's very hard to place these um, stockings on the doll because it was stuck on... On the thigh part, see? It haven't reached the butt. <laughs> okay. Alright, and this doll of mine is not wearing any undies. But I think it's fine with this. So, yeah. There you go with the fitting of the stockings. But I will not skip the fitting of the stockings for the obitsu and as well as for kupush. Alright, so here you go. The fitting of the stockings. See? It's just hard to to make it work, okay? To make it wear the stockings. So anyway, let's see. We will not just include the shoes yet because as you can see with the dress here, alright, it's, it's not all the way down. And we have to put the doll there, right? So anyway, let's first make this doll wear the dress like this so with this case we're gonna first detach the arms so we'll be we'll easily fit fit this for the doll wow looks great okay but the problem is <laughs> okay the arms so Forgive the noise. So anyway, let's check what we got. Okay. I just hope the armhole is, is good. Because if it's not again, I will contact again. Good smile with regards to the problem of the clothing. So let's see. Oh dear, it's very hard, my gosh. Oh, there you go. Ooh. <laughs> and then let's place the, the hand. Because I might misplace it somewhere. <laughs> Alright, so anyway. Let's do the same thing with this one. So, this first, okay. Then, wow, it, it fits. It's um, It's not... What do you call this? It's not too tight because before it was too tight with um, the Red Queen's clothes. It's very hard to wear for the doll. Um, I don't usually use my that clothing for my dolls. So let's now close it. So for the flat chest, the doll, yeah, it fits very well. Obviously on the top portion and then let's see about the apron If things will go well with the apron if it will fit mm -hmm. I hope we won't have a hard time with the fitting <laughs> Oh 
come on <laughs> feet <laughs> my gosh it's hard to <laughs> there you go <laughs> wow just need to be careful not to destroy the whole thing <laughs> so and then we'll just try the shoes and this is my problem look at that I just hope it won't be a problem on fitting the shoes but let's see so this is the right okay so this is the right of my Nando right foot <laughs> oh my gosh i hope i won't destroy the shoes wow it fits well for the right part but i just hope we do well with this with this one <sighs> i hope it won't be a problem i hope it's wow it still fit yay so <laughs> My Nando doll is happy. Oops. <laughs> My gosh, I forgot. I got I forgot to make it wear <laughs> the body. <laughs> Here you go. Okay. Yay. <laughs> what happened to the arms? So yeah, happy doll, and I'm wearing actually long neck, but I think the neck portion, hmm, I don't know if it's just right, but this is how it looks like for the Nando doll with flat chest. This is the front side. Let's make it like this, okay? side oops <laughs> as you can see i wasn't able to properly lock it oh my gosh sorry forgive i didn't notice <laughs> so for the headgear no we don't have a headgear okay for this one so i don't have any headgear for her so here is the front the side the back side and then this one Okay, forgive the damage, okay? Um, this doll have been used for years. <laughs> for the video, right? You can see her in the video. Alright, so... Well, that's the fitting goes for this Nando doll with flat boobs. <laughs> right, so for the next, we will gonna try the dress for the Nando doll with big boobies okay so um in this case situation i already made this doll wear the stockings so i won't have a hard time later later on okay so anyway let's see i'm just gonna remove the head so that you won't have a hard time on making the doll wear the clothes all right so the arms too gonna put it aside so okay i hope that i can be able to wear even though i already fit the shoes on this doll so now let's see if it will fit the nando doll with big boobs oops Actually, it's hard to to place if the doll has the shoes on already. Okay, there you go. And then, let's place the arms. Just like what we did lately. We will remove the hand first and then place the arm. There you go. And then the other. Actually, this is the body that I usually make my Nando doll wear. 
and the other one is just from a male body to be honest with you I don't have a list all yet <laughs> all right so anyway let's see since I'm not into do forgot I should do this <laughs> sorry I've been talking a lot that I forgot what I'm doing <laughs> Forgive guys, alright? So anyway Let's see There you go And here it is So the fitting Wow It fits the doll with boobies That's great And then let's make it Let's make this And then the doll wear the apron uh -huh. There you go. Okay. So. Tada! So for the finished product, we're gonna place the head. So for this, I'll be using a neck joint with a long neck. The long, the long one because the, the dress has a collar, see? Alright, so there you go. So this is how it looks like. <laughs> the side. The back. The ribbon is not that shown guys I don't know why what's the effect of this <laughs> why is it like that but there you go it's not that bulky it's just when you look like this I'm sorry when you look this way okay so yeah this is the back this is the side This the bottom. I I forgot to include it, um, the feature lately. So, top. <laughs> wow, very nice clothes. So it fits well for you know um an endo doll body with boobies. <laughs> this is great news, guys. All right, so let's proceed on with the next doll. All right, so for the next is the kapush body all right so let's begin on by removing the head so that we may be able to fit the clothes itself oh dear it's very hard to oh <laughs> i thought it's like nandaroid oh dear it's what do you call this? I, I have not been doing this for a very long time to be honest i almost forgot all right so let's see let's remove the plastic so let's see how these um stockings will fit this doll okay so let's begin pardon guys for those who use skoposh <laughs> my bad i forgot how to you know how to use skoposh doll see how long i've not been in this hobby i really miss it a lot to be honest with you i just been busy <sighs> that feeling if you can't play with your with your dolls and get on with your hobby so obviously guys it's very very long for kopush you have to cut out these stockings Okay, to make it work. <laughs> Probably same goes with a Sylvanian, you know, body. You have to cut it out to make it work. See? Obviously, it's too big. <laughs> See that? It's too big. Alright, so let's begin. Let's make this doll wear, wear the dress. 
um, but it's very hard to release the arms to be honest um, actually I don't remove the plastic because the original dress of this doll is black so anyway let's make it fit the, the dress okay here we go <laughs> it's cute <laughs> it's it's too big obviously for this doll and i can't hardly see the arms <laughs> oh my gosh oh there you go the other arm yeah there you go all right and then let's fit the arm the hands all right so here you go and then oh this could push bodies thinner than the nendo dolls okay see that so let's make this neck this kopush doll has a small neck so there you go about the fitting it fits obviously to be honest it looks cute on the kopush but this is the original fit of the kopush see okay this is the fitting this is the side this is the back side okay i wasn't able there you go and then this is the front but you know um we can't fit this because the feet of the kopush is bigger than nando dolls nando dolls you know feet that's why i don't want to fit because it might break the shoes See how wide their, their feet is. Okay, so yeah, that there you go. For the kopush. <laughs> Isn't it cute? Alright, so let's see if it will fit well for Obitsu body. So as just well, we begin on with... With this, okay, with the stockings part, all right. So let's see. Again, I will not fit the shoes, guys, okay, because um, it might destroy the f the shoes itself. Okay, a bit so feet is bigger than Nando doll's feet. All right, so let's begin on. So, hmm. I'm really sorry about the noise, guys. I do my unboxing every morning. Because if I use the lighting for the evening, it's not going to be a good view. Especially if I'm unboxing something that has plastic on it. Okay. Because the packaging, remember, has a plastic. Anyway. <laughs> It really has this funny. Okay. It's normal. Because if you sew a, a stocking or socks, you'll have this. Okay. Underneath. Okay, so for the stocking obviously it's it's too it's too small for the obitsu because here is 
here is the waist part and the stocking just can just go all this way all right and obviously i can't remove the head of this a bit too so i will just go ahead and remove the arms and then the hand as well just like what i always do so let's I'll just remove first the first so I won't get confused. So let's see, I forgot which hand this is. Oh, this is for the... I begin first with this one, okay? <laughs> like what I usually do. I might get confused. <laughs> My gosh, please forgive me, guys. Okay. I need to take it easy. For those who ask what Obitsu this is, this is 11cm Obitsu and... This model is Hikari, okay? I got Hikari with three eyes, okay? And I'm the one who chose the eyes for the Sobitsu and the hair. I bought it separately. So anyway, that's your information. I bought it from Nando Farm. Philippines is a location, but I don't know if she sells um stuff or sh she sells stuff abroad too <laughs> i'm not sure she's located in the philippines so anyway just for those whom who are curious okay where i bought the item so here you go <laughs> this is the arm so I also have something upcoming and I'm still thinking if I'm gonna keep the doll or if I will sell the doll. I I just need one doll, to be honest, and obviously I will keep Hikari because I use her for fitting for fitting stuff, okay, on my videos. So yeah. And I had a lot of memories with Ikari. <laughs> anyway, so here it is. Okay, the fitting is very nice. And let's see if the apron will fit too. Actually, if you ask about um, the size of the dress, it's knee, okay? see this is the knee part so that's how long the dress is on obitsu sorry i didn't share that okay um with the dando doll but you see that i rotated the doll okay for you to have an idea so it looks like a ballet <laughs> it's so cute okay so let's see wow it fits really well Okay, so anyway, here it is. Isn't she lovely? So this is the... Sorry, we can't match the shoes, okay? Since I don't want to destroy the shoes, alright? It just fits Nando dolls. So this is the front. Okay, of the doll, this is the, the side. This is how big the the dress is okay this is almost above the knee okay in the fitting so this is the back <laughs> look at that <laughs> even though <laughs> so obviously you know um these stockings is so small for her all right, but if you want to make um, the obitsu fit it, you have to cut, guys, or you have to make an adjust 
adjustment okay that's what you need to do um but i will not destroy obviously the stockings i will make it um work for my obitsu doll so anyway here is the back it fits perfectly well and then this is the side this is the front so yeah it fits obitsu it fits all the dolls except for you know um the shoes that's a conclusion there and for for the socks or the stockings it fits well obviously for a bit so i'm sorry for nandaroid dolls but it's it's big for kubush body and it's small for a bit so dolls so and the dress itself and apron it works well for you know both the nando doll that has flat and big boobs and it also fit for kopush but it looks bigger for kopush and for a bit so it looks still nice okay it's above the knee size for you know a bit so so for the shoes it only fits for nando dolls take note guys okay you don't have to force the dolls to make it work because you might destroy the shoes so anyway i hope you enjoyed this unboxing and sending you all peace love and light bye